these are the top reasons why you shouldn't care about the Will Smith and Chris Rock issue. So reason number one, everybody in that auditorium was is at least a millionaire. And that's just real truth. They're already successful. So what do you have to feel a certain way and feel sorry and oh my goodness this happened you know focus on your own lives they always hit us with these distractions and satan wants to do that to distract you from your purpose these people are millionaires so we already know it's nonsense reason number two the oscars had low ratings so this altercation boosted the ratings and it's the fact last year i think for the past couple years uh it's supposedly been run by black people and so it's a, it's a, it's on it's a shame that stupid things have to take place, uh, and then you can say that, well, then black people are running it; they're being silly, and this is the left, this is the woke movement. Look at the Oscars; it's buffoonery; it's, it's nonsense. Just to boost the ratings, they have to have some drama. Reason number three: Chris Rock had already planned to go on tour, um, but since the altercation, he has actually sold out tickets to his tour now. So after all of a sudden he gets slapped and all of a sudden uh, now his his whole show is sold out. So um, you can say if it's planned or not, it seems pretty planned because now the guy's going on tour and it's already sold out and people want to side with him like he's a victim. He's not a victim, people. Reason number four, Will says he wants to be a vessel for love, but he also slapped somebody uh, right after he slapped somebody. So uh, big question there. That's not what love does. Love doesn't hit anybody. So. That's a that's a that's a red flag right there. Hollywood reason number five: Hollywood runs many rituals for fame and money. They're all actors. Uh, these rituals take place because again, it's all about money and fame. The world is run by money. Um, whenever you, you if you just look around, everything comes back to money. People do everything for money. Um, this is what these societies are built on. These cities are built on. It's all gossip. It's money. It's nonsense. This is what they do. They do everything for money as well as to confuse the people and to make sure that you're distracted. And um, yeah, they, they want you to focus on their lives. They're so selfish. They want you to focus on their lives and they don't want you to focus on your own lives. You know, you guys all have your own problems and your own issues in your own lives. Focus on that. Why turn on the TV and be bewildered and focusing on somebody else's nonsense again that is they're only there for money fame and riches which is nonsense most people don't know these people like we know of them in media but we don't actually know these people so why do we care that's a great question a simple question why do people care about people they don't even know like you don't actually know these people bro how they feel what they think how they move like you know what i mean why? Why even care? Now, reason number six, um, I guess if, if people were tuning in and seeing, again, I only saw clips, I didn't actually watch it, but even Denzel was tearing up and Will Smith was crying, right? Tearing up, etc. Uh, again, he even told you it's not because of the word, and he didn't even cry because of his actions. He was crying truly because of, they understand, they've been, they've been in the, that industry for decades, they know the rituals they do they know what they have to do and they sold their soul to be rich and famous that's the notoriety they wanted uh to deal and to be part of this satanic hollywood club uh these are the same people that are shrub shoulder to shoulder with jeffrey epstein uh harvey weinstein bill cosby etc etc there's so many of these names these are the people and the things they do the pedophilia rings rings the wicked satanic practices it's all what they do. That's why they're crying. So when the dude's up there getting an award, he's crying because of, he knows everything he had, he's, he's had to go through and what he does, and they keep the secrets. So I have no respect for these people. You shouldn't either. Um, it's just nonsense. Now let's jump into something spiritual now. And I'm going to read from 1 Peter chapter 3. 1 Peter 3, verses 10 to 12. For who among you delights in life, longs for time to enjoy prosperity? Guard your tongue from evil, your lips from any breath of deceit. Turn away from evil and do good. Seek peace and pursue it. 
For the eyes of the Lord are upon the upright, his ear turned to their cry, but the Lord's face is against those who do evil. 